Judges at the highest United Nations court ordered Japan on Monday to halt whaling in the Antarctic, rejecting the country's arguments that the catch was for scientific purposes. The International Court of Justice sided with plaintiff Australia in finding that the scientific output of the whaling program was modest in comparison with the number of whales killed. It said no further scientific whaling licenses should be issued. Japan signed a 1986 moratorium on whaling, but has continued to hunt up to 850 mink whales in the icy waters of the Southern Ocean each year, citing a 1946 treaty that permits the killing of giant mammals for research. Agent of Japan Koji Suraoka told journalists Japan was disappointed by the ruling. Uh, Japan uh, regrets and is deeply disappointed uh, that uh, JARPA 2 the second phase of the Japanese uh, research whaling in the Antarctic uh, has been ruled by the court as not falling within the scope of uh, or the provisions of Article 8, Paragraph 1 of uh, ICRW. However, as a state that respects rule of law, the order of international law, and as a responsible member of the global community, Japan will abide by the decision of the court. Conservation Society Sea Shepherd's advisor, Giet Vons, told journalists the judgment is a strong and positive statement. Uh, I don't know if Japan will proceed with their whaling. They, they might find a new program, a new uh, scientific research program in the future. But for the moment, I feel very confident that it will not happen because as the judge said, they should, be, they should fulfill their obligations, they should meet standards, and they have not done so far. The international uh, scientific uh, uh, yeah, community has to support, there has to be peer review articles, etc., etc. So this is, a, I think, a very positive, strong statement. Whaling was once widespread around the world, but Japan is now one of only a handful of countries that continues the practice. The meat is popular with Japanese consumers who consider it a delicacy. Judges agreed with Australia that the research, two peer-reviewed papers since 2005, based on results obtained from just nine killed whales, was not proportionate to the number of animals killed.